Back in 2007, when Greensburg was nearly destroyed by a tornado, I saw the opportunity for students to be able to get in the town, to work there, and use it as a classroom. Three, two, one. This is what's left of Starless Shop, and just walking around. Sorry, go back again. I think the advantage of being able to go to where you're reporting is that you don't get away from it. We couldn't go home at night. It wasn't just a classroom. They weren't just, you know, inputting their story, typing on their computer, and turning it in and going home. They lived this for two weeks. I don't think I was fully prepared for how devastating um, it was. In spite of all of the damage, the spirits of people were up. We've been very fortunate, very blessed. What, what I saw that was great was how students interacted, not only with me and with each other, but members of the community, and how their sources for stories grew each day. You get thrown out into the real world, and to me, that's the best way to learn. Getting to know people that I never would have known without going to Greensburg. It was more than just a class. I hardly ever thought about grades. It's about people. We cook together, we work together, and you know, we live these stories. Uh, that's something you can't get in a classroom on an hour or hour and a half twice a week. I really, really enjoy the collaboration and, and Les is just great, um, just a great teacher. My reason I chose Wichita State was because of the Elliott School. I felt like I would get a lot of hands-on experience. The classes are small enough that you can get to know your professors. It's a great learning environment. It's, it's, it's somewhere where you can um, really pull on the expertise of the different faculty members that we have here. Going to Greensburg, having that experience at such an early age has helped me in all of my classes.